Hi, I'm Cindy Bernard. I'm an artist. I'm in the collection here at MOCA. I'm also the founding director of SASIS, uh, which is an experimental music organization here in Los Angeles. I'm also the co-founder of MOCA Mobilization. When I was 14 years old, the Midnight Special, which was a late night concert program in LA, aired the 1980 Floor Show, which was a concert by David Bowie. It was wild. At the height of Bowie's theatricality, it was full of sexual ambiguity, really crazy costumes. But about five or six years ago, clips started to show up on YouTube. The one that I was always fascinated by was a duet with Marianne Faithful, I Got You Babe. Babe. I got you, babe. Bowie, who's wearing these red PVC tight pants and two big feathers covering his breasts, and Marianne Faithful is wearing a nun's habit. I've heard that this actually never aired in the United States because it was considered too bizarre, too controversial. Thank you very much. I've probably known Mike Watt of Minutemen fame longer than anyone else except for my family. The Joy at Sea show, which is a show where the Minutemen played on a boat as it toured the San Pedro Harbor. And the song I chose is History Lesson Part 2, which actually makes me tear up when I even think about it. It's, it's really such a, a privilege in a way to have had your high school experience captured in a song. It, it also captured, I think, the way we felt empowered to be whatever it was we were going to be. Um, and I, I think the other reason I chose this clip is this is actually the way I remember Mike and Dee Boone and George from back in high school. The Morning Song by Eva Petova and Pavel Fajic. The story goes that the filmmakers knocked on their door very early in the morning, camera in hand, so they were awakened and then asked to perform. You can still see the imprint of the bed sheets on Eva's face. It's really just such an intimate and fragile performance. Mm -hmm. 